I lived a crazy cool upbringing, but nobody escapes childhood unscathed. Some of the most painful experiences of my life happened before I turned 18. I am grateful for every single one of those experiences, and this is why. Imagine with me for a moment the symbolism from the Law of the Leper in the book of Leviticus. For a leper to be cleansed, a priest would take two birds. The first bird is sacrificed in an earthen vessel. If you were like me when I read this for the first time, you feel sadness for the second bird because you know what happened to the first, so see what is coming. Why does it have to die too? But no, in mercy, the second bird is dipped in the blood of the first, then pronounced clean and set free into an open field. The Savior gave his life so we could not only live, but live free of all that would bind us. It makes sense that we would then choose to give our lives back to him. How many of us essentially clip our own wings with guilt, shame, resentment, anger, thoughts of worthlessness? How many of us are hopping around on the ground instead of spreading our wings and flying? Which view would you rather have in this life? Every pain, every joy is so we can become what the Savior sees in us. Nothing is so beautiful than to be cleansed and set free, but that can never happen if there is nothing to be cleansed and set free from. The Savior doesn't cause this pain to happen. It is an inevitable part of life, but he is there to take that pain and use it to teach us to fly. What will we do with our lives that are saved because of the first life that was given?